Hello, Robin. Um, I don't have, but I didn't have very much to say about this week. And I wasn't really sure what I was going to do the video on. But today and yesterday, I did a couple of like online assessment tests for jobs. I'm just going to rant about those <laughs> because I have nothing else to say. So I did one and it was like this personality test thing and it's like I don't know it's kind of stupid that they think they can like categorize a person based on their answers in this test and I was a bit annoyed by it so I decided I was just gonna answer it completely honestly where they're like they'll ask a question like oh, do you like to help others resolve issues or would you rather let them sort it out on their own it's just like no I'm not having anything to do with that leave it to them so I just answered it all and gave a very clear picture of what I'm like but it's like there was this section in it where it's like it gives you a, a sort of situation at work and you have to decide how constructive various solutions are it's like oh Darren has he's got an illness and he thinks that it would he would work better if he was relocated somewhere else how would you rank all of these things and it's just like well it depends because everything depends how you like how I'm meant to answer this but then it reckons that there's like a, a concrete answer for each of them like oh, this is the right answer it's like well it might have been I don't know. And then today, I did another one that was worse. And like, it was so bad. So for a start, it requires you to, it's not like in a web browser, you have to install this like unverified program on your computer. So it's like, fine, I'll do that. And then it's, just like these weird sort of hand-eye coordination exercises where it's like, oh, stop the bar when it is over the right number. It's like, how, how is this going to tell you how good at doing a job I'm going to be? And like, <laughs> it's so dumb. And then you got I got an email back from it. It was like, well, we should decide like since you put the time into it we'll give you some feedback and tell you how you did so I was like oh, fair enough I'll read it and like the, the stuff that comes back it's not even about like how like quick you were or like any of this stuff it like thinks that it's figured out stuff about your personality from it it's like oh you're a very social person because I like click the boxes quickly or like have a good memory so, oh my god <laughs> It's so dumb. It's wound me up so much. But I don't really care about either of these jobs anyway. I don't want them. I want any of the jobs I'm applying for. <laughs> it's like, all the, the jobs that you're looking at, I want those. Like, I don't know, if I had a, if I had to do my degree again, I think I would have chosen different modules or something because, like... It's, no one cares <laughs> that I'm good at maths. I wish I'd done like engineering or something sometimes. But I did want to do maths. Like maths was fun. But it's just useless. <laughs> I felt useless when I was doing it. But I was promised that it wouldn't be. I don't know. And like even when you look through the jobs. And like there's ones that you couldn't get now. But it's like oh maybe a couple of jobs down the road. It's like if I had done two years as like data specialist that wouldn't help me get that job it would just help me get like I don't know nothing it doesn't seem to go anywhere like everything needs a PhD or like a different degree or like better programming maybe I should just like scrap everything I've done in my life learn like learn software engineering and start fresh from there I don't know oh, I hate it but <laughs> this was uh, therapeutic. <laughs> Thanks for listening. I'm looking forward to Friday. I'll see you then. <laughs> Stay old.